The Inspector General of Police has assured Nigerians that the Police Act 2020, which lays foundation for a lot of reforms, will be implemented. He made this known when the Minister of Youth and Sports paid him a courtesy visit in Abuja. Miriam Mohammed reports. The outrage over recent activities of the Federal Special anti robbery Squad is still fresh in the public space. The anger of citizens, especially youths, come from years of enduring undue harassment by the FSARS officers, which have gone unchecked. Their recent actions attracted condemnations even from Vice President and the Speaker of House of Representatives. It prompted a swift reaction from the Inspector General of Police. Now Nigerians wait keenly to see if he will enforce his ban on SARS and other tactical squads from carrying out stop and search routines across the country. This visit by the Minister of Youth and Sport is to deliberate on how unnecessary harassment of youth by police officers can be curtailed. The Inspector General of Police tells his visitor that a stern warning has been issued to the commissioners of police in charge of FSARS, state commands, and that of the FCT, as well as their supervisory zonal assistant inspector general of police, that they will be held liable for any misconduct within their area of responsibility. Our responsibility and function is to protect the citizens and the property within the country, and that we must do. Any individual within us that goes contrary to his training, if they go contrary to that, we will not let them go free. The Minister of Youth and Sports acknowledges that the youths need to play a part by being civil, law-abiding and open opportunities created by government to improve their lot. I just urge them to be law-abiding, but also to apply themselves to the opportunities created by government. There are quite a number, over a dozen opportunities for our youth. They need to plug in, they need to apply themselves to this opportunity, and hopefully we can turn the tide. The Nigerian police force wants members of the public to exercise patience as it has measures put in place to check the excesses of SARS. Maria Mohamed, TVC News, Abuja.